guys, it's Melody Blue. Welcome back. I survived the tornado warning. Of course, it happened a couple times after that, too, but I was up all night. And I'm pretty sleepy and pretty tired. But, I got something from Amazon that I gotta share with y'all. Y'all know that. It's not a big haul, because can't afford to buy too many coloring books right now, but I did want to bring this one to you. This is 50 Snowflakes to Color, and I'm going to mess her name up, but it's Camellia Angelkova, Angelkova, I don't know, but that's her name, and that's the name of the book. Of course, you can already tell, Amazon paper. So, let's do a flip through. These are beautiful. They're not mandalas, and they're not uh, Celtic. Snowflakes. These are just plain old snowflakes. Love it. Just love it. These are beautiful. I'm loving this one. And like I said, it's a. Uh, not all snowflakes are six-sided. There's eight-sided, there's four-sided. Yeah. So they're not exactly... It just depends on the, uh, the kind of water and... If it was in high altitude where it formed or lower altitude, it just... Let's get off the science. This is cold. Alright. Let's get a move on here. I hope y'all can see this, because I cannot see the view. I can't see. I can't see what I'm filming. So I just have to. And they're printed only on one side, which I like that. Just don't like the paper. What I will do is I'm going to get my light board out and... Trace some of these on my cardstock. That's what I'm gonna do. These are just beautiful snowflakes, guys. I know it's snowflake, but generally, you know, they're in snowflake form. They're, they're beautiful. I've always loved to see snowflakes. And I like to see ice crystals on the glass. Yeah, I love to see that. Uh, oh, beautiful. Just beautiful. Like I said, they're only printed on one side. Which is a plus in my book. Beautiful pictures. Um, this is going to be one of my favorites. I can already tell you that. Some of them are pretty intricate. And then some of them not. Ooh. Some of them are pretty simple and some of them just like that. That's intricate right there. Oh my god. I think... No, it's not. Beautiful, guys. Beautiful. I'm going to have to save up some money so I can buy some more coloring books. My fundage is low since I bought them Derwent. So i got to save back up. These are just beautiful. This is designs in snowflake form 
All right, baby blue. Uh-uh. It's not time yet. That's my dog. Baby blue. <sighs> Miss Baby Blue. There's nothing wrong with her, guys. She's not sick. Uh, for the ones that don't know, uh, I adopted her. And the people that had her before me had her bark box cut. So instead of her being able to make a yipping noise, you know, try to get your attention, yap, 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 she can't do that. All she can do is squeak like that. She's not sick. She just don't have a bark box to yell at me with. Ha, ha, ha. Baby Blue. Yeah, I'm talking to you. That's enough. I'm Melody Blue, and she's Baby Blue. Would you cut that out? No. My dog is spoiled. Okay. Back to this. I, I hope y'all have been working on your... Uh... Tiger Lily. And you know they come in more colors than just orange. They got pink. All you gotta do is do a Google search for tiger lilies and they come up and oh my god some of the colors and I'm just lightly layering I'm not I'm not doing nothing special except going from light to dark and then back and most people will take their colored pencil and mash hard to make the dots. I don't do that because they won't look. Well, they won't look nor they, they won't. They'll look like somebody painted a dot. It's not what we want. What we want is uh, make it look like it's. It don't have a sharp edge to them. Okay. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. And this kind of stroke that I'm doing here, it's called hatching. And this is how you want to do it. Um, let me show you. Okay. Now... When you're layering, you want to start with your pencil down and lift up. Down, lift up. Down, lift up. That's that's what hatching is. And this is what you need to do. Light layers, you just start hatching. And you can go back over it. Hatching again. And then you can direct where you want your darkest and where you want your lightest. Like that. See, like, I've made it lighter there than I have out here. That's because I didn't go up there with the hash. But, yeah, this is hatching, and if you watch me, this is how I do it. And I would suggest you go back. Don't ever do this. Well, you can, but... It, not in the situation we're in. But you do want to cross hatch to get your color in. And then we go this way. This is, you know, this is how, this is how I was taught to do it by Miss Lori. Cross hatch. So you can get that pigment. You can get more pigment on your paper by cross hatching than you would just by doing it. Um, like I said, um, taught by Miss Lori, uh, that, that's the way you do it. So that's what I do.
even on the parts that are just shadow, I'm hatching. Just hatching. That's what I wanted to tell you guys about, and I didn't the other day, is that, you know, even on just layer them dots, because, uh, Now we go back to the lightest color. And see how saturated you can get your color when you do it by layering. And I, like I said, I'm layering even the shadow areas I'm layering. Well, there's the sun. Fine. Well, there it goes. I think I, I really do like these Derwent color soft. And I think I think I like them better than Prismacolor. Um, I don't know if the color soft comes in more than 72 or not, but, you know, you know, when you have 72 colors, or even if you don't have 72 colors, if you have 24, you can blend your colors together to get whatever color it is you're wanting. And, uh, now, for thin lines, like this, I will mash down hard, because, just because, but y'all can be coloring on your, if you're coloring along here, just go ahead and finish your flower, or if you're coloring on a different coloring page, just keep going the way we're going here. It's going to be the same process. All, all your petals are going to be just done just alike. So, uh, yeah. So, alrighty. I hope y'all can see that. Um, I want to tell everybody I love you very, very much. Um, all I could think about last night was the tornado warnings. Is I wish, I wish that I could be with y'all and, uh, get through it. But we got through it. And, uh, but I, I wanted to, uh, get with y'all and uh, let you know that I made it. I made it all right. And... I'm okay, and uh, I need y'all to run them likes up for me. That way, other people can find my videos just like you did for this last year. So let's let's get the let's get it out there. Um, I'm trying to get to a thousand right now. Um, I just found out it takes a hundred thousand to get the. Uh, YouTube play button, but right now I just want to get to a thousand, and we can do that by y'all running them likes up, running them shares up, subscribing. If you're not subscribed and you like what you see, click the subscribe button, then click on the little bell icon and click all, and you'll get all notifications. Okay, guys, well, that's going to do it for me. I love y'all very, very much. And until the next one, peace out. Bye.